Alright, this is my gaming computer and I'm going to be switching out my graphics card. Uh, I did not build this computer. It was made, or it was built by Fry's Electronics. I just picked out all the parts. And they did really nice cable management. As you see, all the cables are kind of tied up with whatever this is, Velcro or whatever. And the only thing that I don't like about it is the, the fact that the back panel is all dented up and it's really hard to put this back on, but it's alright. I'm going to take off this front panel first. Alright. This is a GeForce GTX 980, and I'm going to be switching it out with a new graphics card. So right now we're on a granite tabletop and a, like a tiled floor so that there's no static. So this computer obviously isn't connected to any power. You don't want, you don't want it to be connected to power when you're taking stuff out. So this is this cable is what gives the graphics card its power. So you want to take these two things out. And then on the outside, where you plug in your monitor, right now it's kind of secured in this place. So if you come over here, like so. Ah. And it's still going to be secured because oh, also you don't want to lose these. Look how dusty it is, dude. You gotta clean that up. Normally when you open up a computer for, and you haven't done it for a long time, it's going to be pretty dusty. That's kind of normal. So what do you, how do you clean it? So you, you, well, you, want to, you would want to take it outside and kind of blow it off with a blow dryer, but I'm not going to do that. Okay, we'll so, do it later. So I took out these screws and see, the only thing that's keeping it in place is the little thing it's connected to, So which is this thing right here. See this little tab I'm pointing to? You have to push that in. Oh. You have to push this tab in until it's unlocked. See, it's unlocked. Now you just kind of pull the graphics card out. Awesome. And this is a this is a EVGA for the win GTX 980. So it's not the Founder's Edition like I'm going to be installed today. It's pretty cool. I love this thing. It's awesome. I'll put it right here. For like a, the past year, I've always been planning to get in a new graphics card for my birthday. And uh, originally I was going to get the GTX 1080 because that's what that card was out. It was pretty much the best at the time other than the Titan X. But two weeks ago or some, like, something, something like that, a new card came out called the 1080 Ti and it's supposedly faster than the Titan X. So let's just open it right up. This is the graphics card case, and there's tape on it. I'm just gonna be removing that. It's not the best thing to re remove it with, that's for no, sure. No, it's not a knife or anything, but... So another reason why I wanted to get a new graphics card was because... Um, mine, my GTX 980 was kind of acting up. Like, just today I was playing, playing Counter-Strike, and my monitor lost connection to my computer. And oh, <laughs> my, my monitor lost connection to my computer. Computer. So that's another reason why I wanted to get a new card. Whoa, this thing is massive. This is brand new. Um, Obviously. Yes, and it's very efficient. It's probably more efficient than my other card. It takes about the same uh, power wattage. This is the manual ton of stuff. Um, quick start guide, I guess, how you install it, or what these ports are. These are the, um, the ports where you plug in your monitor. What's this? Oh, it's DVI. So this is the DVI adapter. So if you have a monitor that connects to this kind of port, you've seen one of these, right? Yeah. If, if you have a monitor that connects one of these ports, the graphics card itself actually doesn't have this port. It only has like these video video ports. Um, so this is an adapter, so you can plug it into the monitor and then plug it into your. I mean, plug it into the graphics card and then plug it into your monitor. So that's pretty cool. Wow, that's big. It is very big. And another thing that is new about this graphics card here. I'm gonna go get my other one. So this one, so this is technically the top of the graphics card. It kind of sits in your computer like this. And see how all of this is exposed? 
with the new Pascal graphics cards, there's a plating over it, so none of this stuff is exposed, which is pretty cool. This is the graphics card. Um, the new Pascal design, kind of, it's more polygonish. It looks really cool. Also, there's this little tape that you have to take off. These are, this is probably everyone's favorite part of installing graphics cards is taking this little thing off. Oh. <laughs> Pretty cool. In the back, it's like this. So to install it, just like how you install the other thing, turn yeah. it upside down because this is right side up. And I'm going to put it in the top one. So actually, before I do that, all right. So I'm actually going to put it in the very top one because my I, I want to install the 980 again back into this one. So I'm just going to take this one because I'm going to have multiple monitors and my 980 is going to control the other monitor. So you have to take, before you install graphics cards, there are going to be this little thing you have to take out and okay here we go okay so you're gonna want to undo these guys and then it's gonna be this plate is gonna kind of be secured on it so so you do have to take out two panels because that's how thick the graphics card is it should kind of making sure I have room So it's in, now you just have to um, screw it into place, so. Oh, maybe. Here, I'm gonna screw this one in. It's just this upper one. That's good. Don't forget to plug these guys in. So depending on what graphics card you have, this one takes quite a bit of power just because it's a really powerful graphics card. You may have you may have one of these. You may have two of them. One of them, two of them might be three. Uh, one of them might be four. It really depends on the graphics card. All right. So once you have your card in, you can install. Um, if you still have to install these little guys, if there's like gaps right here, you can. I was going to install this, my 980 again, under it, but I don't have these right now, so. Yeah, and if you have a NVIDIA graphics card like this is, um, there's a program called NVIDIA GeForce Experience, and if, if you have a, if you have this, oops, if you have this kind of graphics card, um, then that software will give you um, driver updates for your card whenever another one comes out. Then there's one more at the very top. That's it. It's green. Yay.